it in today's lesson, I'm going to give you more example using passive voice. Remember, when we write passive voice, we change the focus of the sentences. But first, we need an active voice. But in this moment, I'm going to give you some example using present simple and passive. If your active voice is in present simple, for example, the teacher buys a new book, remember to use the grammar instructions. Verb to be in present simple. Because your active voice is in present simple, your verb to be is going to be in present simple past the past participle of the big verb. For example, a new book is bought by her. Remember, we change the focus of the sentences, and the most important part here is the object of the sentence. Let's see another example, but in this moment, is in past simple. Your active boy is in past simple, so you have to take into account the grammar structure. For example, the teacher bought a new book. The teacher bought a new book. Remember, this is the grammar structure. Verb to be in past simple. Because your active voice is in past simple, your passive boy need these grammar structures. Verb to be in past simple, past plus participle of the main verb. Let's see the example. The teacher bought a new book. What did the teacher buy? A new book. So this is the subject in this sentence. A new book was bought by her. All right, so we are going to write an objective pronoun. All right, so I hope all this information can help you to do your exercise. In this section, we have funny exercise. So I hope you can do it very well. Bye-bye.